Did you know that VS Code makes it easy to quickly evaluate expressions in Python files? With the Python extension installed, all you need to do is select the text you want to evaluate and then press Shift Enter or Shift Return. This will open up a new Python environment and evaluate the selected expression. You can see in my text file up here, I had 123 plus 456 selected, and down in the Python environment here, it's gone and evaluated the expression and then printed the result. If I wanted to evaluate the next line, so line two here, I can just go and select that and then press Shift Enter or Shift Return, and you can see that this expression has been evaluated as well. One useful time-saving tip is that if you're just evaluating the entire expression here, so the entire line, all you need to do is place your cursor somewhere on that line. You don't need to make a selection. And then when you press Shift Enter or Shift Return, it will actually just automatically select the entire line. So you don't need to make a manual selection if you want the entire line evaluated. You can go and make a selection if you want just part of a line evaluated. So let's say I wanted one, two, three, plus four evaluated here. So now it's only going to evaluate the selected text. You can see that I get 127 because it has not evaluated the rest of the numbers that are outside of that selection. One thing to keep in mind when using this feature is that it's always going to run the selected expression in a consistent Python environment. So let's go down here to line five where we're trying to go and access a value from an array. So I'm gonna place my cursor on line five and then press shift enter or shift return. And you can see in this case, it's actually telling us that the value we're trying to access, so array in this case, is not defined. That is because we did not actually evaluate the line above which uh, defines array. So the, when you're pressing shift enter or shift return, it is really just going to evaluate the current line, not anything outside of it. If you want this code to work correctly, we can go in here and then first evaluate line four. And now we have defined array down here, and then we can evaluate line five. And now the code will start doing the right thing. Of course, we could have just selected both lines as well. So if I go in here and select both lines, now it will evaluate both lines at the same time and we get the same result. Another thing to remember is that this is just a standard Python REPL environment. So you could actually go into here and just start typing expressions as well. So down here in the terminal, I could say something like array two, and it's going to evaluate that in the same environment that we're evaluating the expressions up here. So that's a quick look at how you can evaluate selected text using the Python extension and VS Code.